morning everybody it's uh wednesday morning the 29th of april almost may and i wanted to give you guys a quick update we hadn't gotten uh any batches of eggs in the last couple of days the black and whites uh there's only a couple left we got two goodness a bunch of batches of them and then we did get a, ba a batch of purples that i'm gonna give you an update on because that's kind of funky uh that that whole thing i wanted to so if you're into tegus you're gonna want to hear about that how we crossed a uh, ultra purple with a deep purple uh hoping to get eventually uh, albino black and whites but i wanted to give you guys an update on the on the um on the ice line because we have a lot of demand for the ice the the albinos and the regular ice tegus um and people keep asking how many albinos you're gonna have this year what are they gonna price gonna be well i don't know anything about that yet but let me give you guys a quick update and show you what we got here look at this female here she's a monster she's close to three and a half foot and she's just starting to show the little low belly on there she might be producing coming up with some eggs there just a beautiful animal for you guys that are new to our videos the ice tegu is a very interesting uh tegu that we produce it's a uh it's um 50 black and white 37 percent blue and 13% red, but they're all het for albinism. albinism. So we are gonna get probably 25% out of the eggs that they ha that they lay are gonna be albinos. Now here's the exciting part. That's a big fat female. She should be laying eggs any day. You guys can actually see the eggs out of the side. So how many eggs is that thing gonna lay? Probably in the area of 30. Now look at that animal real quick. I want you to see something. It has, come over the top. It has the nose like a blue tegu. It has the back legs like a black and white. And yet it has the spotting of a red tegu. Pretty very, pretty, pretty cool animal. That's what makes the, uh, the, the ice so interesting is that when they come out, you never know what's gonna be visual. Like those animals that we just showed you, those two first animals are from the same batch. And yet, look how different they are. Look over here. Look at this female over here. She's also on the cusp right any day about to lay. They refused, we were feeding them yesterday and most of them refused food. Look at that beast. I think we're gonna have one crazy day. When those things decide to start laying. So the reason why ice is so special is because when the albinos come out, you also don't know what's gonna be visual there. So you get some of the ice takers that the albinos, and they look more red and we call them cherry ice. Some look more dark and we call them black ice. Some look more light, look at this over here. And we call them lemon ice because they have a lot of yellow in them. Look at the size of that female. She also has the head of the blue tegu. She's got that black nose, which is so typical in the, in the teardrop eye, which is so typical of the blue tegus. But she's got the strong banding of a black and white tegu. And then look at this female, you talk about fat. Look at how fat that beast is. And look how, if you guys can, can see how, how the base of her tail is starting to shrink in, that's how you know. If you're, if you're out there and you're a tegu breeder and you're wondering how, how do I know when my tegu is about to lay eggs, the base of that tail gets really skinny, even though the thickness still remains in it, it starts to lose all of its proteins. Now, look at this here, guys. This is another female. Oh, we, did we show this one yet? Yeah, we showed that one. Yeah, this one here. This is another female. So this is one, two, three, four, five, seven females that are all showing not just signs, but look at the size of that monster. So we're gonna have a lot of ice tegus, hopefully a lot of albinos. 
and we're going to try and get that price down. We've been promising a thousand dollar albinos. It has not happened yet, but I'm thinking this year might be the year the thousand dollar albino. You can check the website. You can reserve yours. Uh, undergroundreptiles.com. I just want to give you guys a quick update. Thank you so much for watching the videos. Have a great day, and we'll keep making takeaway videos when we have them. Whoosh.